أسماء وأبصارا وأفئدة فجعلنا من الشافرين. And you've given us ears that truly hear the truth, eyes that see the truth, and hearts that understand the truth. So please make us amongst those who are grateful. أما بعد فإني لا أعلم أصحابا أصلح منكم. Because I don't know any companions who are better than you. ولا أعلم أهل بيت أبر ولا أوصل ولا أفضل من أهل بيتي. I don't know any family who could be better, more virtuous than my family. But جزاكم الله جميعا عني خيرا. May Allah reward you on my behalf. إن هؤلاء القوم ما يطلبون أحدا غيري. These people, the Kufans, they don't want anyone of you besides me. ولو قد أصابوني وقدروا علي على قتلي لما طلبوكم أبدا. If they get me, if they get their hands on me, and if they kill me, then they're not going to bother any of you. وهذا الليل قد غشيكم فقوموا واتخذوه جملا. The night's dark. Use it. Use it as a, as a camel. Use it as a, a vehicle. Take the night and, and go. وليأخذ كل رجل منكم بيد رجل من إخوتي. And each of you, my companions, take the hand of one of my brothers, one of my one of my ahlul bayt, and and go with them. وَتَفَرَّقُوا فِي سَوَادِ هَذَا الْلَيْنِ Go, disappear in the blackness of the night. وَذَرُونِي وَهَاءُ الْهَرْقُومِ And leave me alone with these people, I'll deal with them. فَتَكَلَّمَ إِخْوَةُ الْحُسَيْنِ وَجَمِيعُ أَهْلِ بَيْتِهِ فَقَالُوا One by one, the companions of the Bayt speak. يَا بْنَ رَسُولِ اللَّهِ فَمَاذَا تَقُولُ النَّاسُ وَمَاذَا نَقُولُ لَهُمْ If we abandon you, then what are people going to say? What are we going to say in response to them? إن تركنا شيخنا وسيدنا وابن بنت نبينا محمد. Should we tell them that we we abandoned our 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 elder, our leader, the son of the Messenger of Allah? ولم نرم معه بسام. We didn't even shoot a single arrow in his protect for his protection. ولم نطع بروم. We didn't use a single spear to protect him. ولم نضرب بسيف. We didn't use a single sword. لا والله. يا من رسولنا. No way. لا نفارقك أبدا. We're never going to part from you. ولكننا نفديك بأنفسنا ونقتل بين يديك ونرد مولدا. We're going to sacrifice ourselves for you. We're going to die in, before you, and we want to enter paradise just as you enter paradise. فقبح الله العيش من بعد. May Allah not let, let us live after you. ثم تكلم مسلم بن عوسجة الأسدي. فقال يا ابن رسول الله أنحن نخليك هكذا وننصرك عنك. Muslim Muta'awsa just speaks in, in his turn. He says, O oh, son of the Messenger of Allah, should we leave you alone and tur turn away from you? Just when your enemies have encircled you? La wallahi, la yarani Allahu wa afalu dalika abada. May Allah never see me if I do such a thing. Hatta ukassira fi sudurihim rumhi wa adriba fihim bisayfi. Not until I break my spear inside of their inside of their chests and strike them down with my sword, ma thabat qaimuhu biyadi. As long as that sword stays in my hands. ولو لم يكن لي سلاح أقاتلهم به لقذفتهم لقذفتهم بالحجارة. And when my sword falls from my hand, I'll throw stones at them. ولم أفارقك حتى أموت بين يدي. But I will not leave you until I die before you. ثم تكلم السعيد بن عبد الله الحنفي. Another companion speaks and says, لا والله يا ابن رسول الله لا نخليك أبدا. We'll never abandon you until Allah knows that we have done our best to protect you after the Messenger of Allah. ووالله لو علمت أني أقتل ثم أحيا ثم أحرق حيا يفعل بذلك السبعين مرة لما فارقتك أبدا حتى ألقي حمامي من دوني. If I were to know that I was to, I was to be killed, then raised to life again, then burnt, and this was to happen to me 70 times, I would never ever leave you until I die before you. And how can I do any, anything else? Why would I do otherwise? It's just one death. And after this death, there's... There's, there's nobility, there's, there's reward that, that will never end after. So why would I not make this one small sacrifice for an eternity of bliss? The group in general said the following, the group of his companions, أَنْفُسُنَا لَكَ الْفِدَاءِ 
may our souls be sacrificed for you. Nafika bi aidina, wa naqika bi aidina, wa wujuhina wa sudurina. We want to protect you with our hands, with our faces, and with our chests. فَإِذَا نَحْنُ قُتِلْنَا بَيْنَ يَدَيْكِ نَكُونُ قَدْ وَفَّيْنَا وَقَضَيْنَا مَا عَلَيْنَا If we die, if we're killed before you, defending you, then we will have fulfilled our oath and we will have fulfilled our obligation. When Imam Hussein sees that his companions are solid in their resolve, أَوْقَفَهُمْ عَلَى غَامِدِ الْقَضَاءِ he lets them see some things from the unseen. فَقَالَ إِنِّي غَدًا أُقْتَلْ He tells them, once he's sure that they're, they're sincere, they're there, they're not leaving, he says, tomorrow I'm, I'm going to die, I'm going to be killed. وَكُلُّكُمْ تُقْتَلُمْ مَعْنِ Each one of you is going to die with me. وَلَا يَبْقَى مِنْكُمْ أَحَدْ حَتَّى الْقَاسِمِ وَعَبْدِ اللَّهِ الرَّبِيمِ Not a single one of you shall remain, not even my, my nephew Qasim, not even my son Abdullah Rabi, a six-month-old child. إِلَّا وَلَدِي عَلِي زَيْنُ الْعَابِدِينَ Except for my one son, Imam Zayn al-Abideen, he will remain. لِأَنَّ اللَّهَ لَمْ يَقْفَعْ نَسْلِ مِنْهُ Allah is not going to cut off the, 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 the chain of, of Imams that's going to continue through him. وَهُوَ أَبُوْ أَئِمَّةٍ ثَمَانِيَةٍ And Imam Zayn al-Abideen is the father of eight Imams. فَقَالُوا بِأَجْمَعِهِمْ أَلْحَمْدُ لِلَّهِ الَّذِي أَكْرَمَنَا فِي نَسْلِ وَشَرَّفَنَا ذِي الْقَتْلِ مَانِ they all praise Allah say, we thank Allah who has ennobled us by letting us help you and by letting us be killed with you. Should we not be happy to be with you at your station, O son of the Messenger of God? ثُمَّ دَعَهَ وَقَالَ لَهُمْ اِرْفَعُوا رُؤُوسَكُمْ وَانْتُمْ And he prays for them. And then he tells them, raise your heads and, and look up. And they could see their station in paradise. And he told them, this is your place in paradise. This is your palace in paradise. This is your mate in paradise. فَكَانَ الرَّجُلُ يَسْتَقْبِلُ الرِّمَاحِ وَالسُّيُوفِ بِصَدْرِهِ وَوَجْهِ لِيَصِلَ إِلَى مَنْزِلِهِ مِنَ الْجَنَّةِ So as they fought the next day, they were fighting with their bodies, they were putting their, their, their bodies into it, but their minds and their hearts were on their places in paradise. وَيُرْوَى أَنَّ الْحُسَيْنِ فِي آخِرِ خُطْبَتِهِ فِي امْتِحَانِ الْأَصْحَابِ قَالَ أَصْحَابِي بَنِي عُمُومَتِي أَهْلَ بَيْتِي أَلَى وَمَنْ كَانَ فِي رَحْلِهِ إِمْرَأَةٌ فَلْيَبْعَثْ بِهَا إِلَىٰ أَهْلِهَا فَإِنَّ نِسَائِي نُسْفَى تُسْفَى وَأَخَافُ عَلَىٰ نِسَائِكُمْ السَّابِ After he tests them and shows them their place in paradise, he tells them that each one of you, a lot of you have women who have come with you. I want each of you to go to your women, whoever's come with you, and, and send them off, and send them back to their families. Because tomorrow my women are going to be captured, and I'm afraid for your women that they'll also be captured along with them. فَقَامَ مِنْ بَيْنِهِمْ حَلِيُّ بْنِ مُضَاهِرُ الْأَسَدِي وَأَخْبَلِ إِلَىٰ خَيْمَتِهِ Habib bin Mudahir's brother Ali, he gets up and he goes to his tent. فَتَبَسَّمَتْ زَوْجَتُهُ فِي وَجْهِهِ فَقَالَ لَهَا دَعِينَا وَالتَّبَسُّمْ She smiles at him when he comes. His wife smiles at him. And he says, leave this smiling on. Why are you smiling? قُومِ وَالْحَقِي he says, rise, I need to go back to your family. Go back and, and, and live with your family. Have I done something wrong? Why, why are you sending me away? No, nothing like that. Did you just hear the Imam Hussein, just, he just gave a speech. She says, yeah, I heard this speech, but I, I didn't hear it. He said something at the end very quietly. I didn't hear what he said. He says, he, he told us that whoever has women, they should send their women home. She knocked her head against the, 